dude, I'm there, like, I'm there for you, I'm taking care of this, don't be, don't be that guy, I will always be there for you, you know, you know, easy, easy picking, oh, blue against blue, maybe, uh, maybe red, thank you, big time, Mr. Rich, There we go. The game is about to start. 1-0 lead for Mr. Rich against Hawk on Secret Valley. And we already saw Hawk struggling on this map against Chechi. But this is a different matchup, so we're gonna jump into it with a clear mind, not having anything to say and just like watching what's happening. So first of all, we're gonna have Hawk spawning at the bottom side of Secret Valley with that beautiful town hall and the light blue roof. Such a beautiful pending job. Good job to the guy that actually did that. And let's go over to the other side of the map. There we go. On the other side of the map, we have the beautiful, most handsome man with the longest hair in 2014, now turning into a human creature and being more, even more beautiful than he was before. Richard Rich, aka Warchief Rich, now playing here the Knight of Race once again. And is this probably a Demon Hunter, right? I, I can't see myself playing a Warden against human on a map with a healing fountain. But let, let's surprise us. Surprise us and bring us some beautiful game of Warcraft. I'm gonna drink something real quick. We're gonna see the first hero choice and it will be a Demon Hunter. And of course, it is the Demon Hunter. It's Mr. Jarakup against Mrs. Jarakup. They both have been married multiple times. They both have been encountered in a Jarakup final multiple times. And they have won this tournament by a really like crazy amount. I'm not even sure about how many times Rich won the tournament. I think like 16 times or something. And also Hawk like 16 or 20 times. Both of the players are really like Mr. and Mr. Mr. and Mrs. Jeddakup. They are still fighting it out who is Mr. and who is Mrs. But just looking at the at the athletics of Mr. Hawk, I think he's definitely Mrs. Also determined by his pussy skills today and being that kind of a douche. Uh, no, just kidding guys. Let's move on with our lives. We don't want to be that bratty little sister reminding us about what just happened to Mr. Cheshmanek. But we're gonna have a demon hunter now claiming the first experience by killing that Gnoll Overseer. That Ancient of War is actually in trouble, needs to be careful to not fall down. And we have a little bit of an odd creeping pattern coming out of Hawk. He's starting with the natural expansion, is killing that other Magi. It takes quite some damage on the Arc Magi though. Dispel is coming in, beautiful Dispel on both of the Water Elementals and Boots of Speed. Pretty much the best item that you can find here in the early game for an arc mage i feel because you just want to escape and run 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 this is just what you what you want to have against the demon hunter he's already level two demon hunter kills the water elemental gets up to level two steals that ogre warrior beautiful should have mana burned the arc mage a little bit faster he was about to have another water elemental and now he gets that i would be surprised if he goes for another rifleman push but what do I know? So we're gonna have a Tree of Ages being upgraded to tier 2 for the Night Elf. Demon Hunter is still looking forward to find some peasants, like some peasant leftovers at the expansion to be sure that there's no expansion the going on right now. Are under Double Moonwell being constructed. Do we have a Hunter's Hole? No, we have like one Archer, we have a second Archer and that Archmage going into the main base. And he's attacking once again, he's going for the Rifleman push. Demon Hunter steals yet another creep, beautifully done there by Rich. Playing his heart out in this game as it feels. And now we see the Archmage just trying to be a pain in the ass by harassing these Moonwells. I'm not sure if he can actually force a cancel. He's dropping lower and lower. This makes it a little bit more scary. Demon Hunter should come in in a second as well as he picks up the Boots of Speed. Now we got the Boots of Speed and the Demon Hunter is looking forward to find the Archmage. It's now going down to the fountain. Just assuming that he will go down there healing up again, and he's absolutely right with that assumption. Beside that, tech is 50% done. We're gonna see a Hunter's Hall in a second, I feel. Demon Hunter is on the chase for the Archmage, but he got Shadow Melt, and he didn't buy any Dust of Appearance. He could have seen that there is like a Shadow. What is it actually called? A Cloak of Shadows, yeah. He could have seen that there's a Cloak of Shadows on the Archmage that will make him able to hide from his opponent. 
but didn't check for that and if you only bought dust of appearance that could have been quite a race for both of the players so demon hunter level 2.5 already with all the steals going on hunter's hall is now the target he should immediately start throwing down a second hunter's hall and as rich as one of the smartest players on this planet he does that of course but hawk aware of that knows that there might be a second hunter's hall coming and immediately goes for the snipe of the second hunter's hall so we're gonna probably see a third hunter's hall attempt somewhere on this planet and it's in the far back of the main base at the same position as it was previously that wisp is about to go down he micros them really well stays alive for now heals up again get some more experience for killing one footman is now going to kill the water elemental yeah more and more experience ancient of lore is a little bit denied but not 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 a really a biggie that beautiful wisp on the high ground witnessing all these traveling passengers going on their own journey wow you guys have quite like quite some looks beautiful just beautiful demon hunter and naga are looking for some pickoffs transfer the boots over to the naga so that she will be easily picking off these footmen and he even knows that the human player went that direction to heal up again and now he's going from the other side naga is just waiting for that opportunity to close in a bunch of these units maybe the rifleman is even the more juicier target and yes he agrees with me one more time rich you are just beautiful you have the same idea about warcraft as i do maybe you should shoot it again please there's a naga coming from the other side so he's probably sacrificing his own naga if he's not getting out of there in time boots of speed helping her out to get out of there boots of speed on hawk's naga as well now demon hunter still not level three now the naga of hawk is in trouble despite the fact that the naga of watchy ridge is also super red cloak of shadows once again saving another hero's life so damn beautiful this Naga is just sitting it out, could easily just try and run back. He wants to wait until the night is over, but the Demon Hunter is putting so much pressure on him that he will probably not be able to escape. Now the Archers should go for the run. Archers, please, Archers, come on. Okay, now they are finally unmelted, or whatever you want to call it. And they are on the run. They are trying to escape. And we have Ancient of Lores coming. A player's forces are under attack. I should tr I, I should try to just whisper whenever it gets intense to make more clear that there's something going on. So three archers and the naga should probably be enough to get rid of that red drake if we get some time to do that. And as it feels, he will get the time. A clause of attack plus six. I would probably give that to the naga to make that red drake disappear a little bit faster. In the meantime, not much is going on. He's desperately looking Players forward to get his Arcan Bolt up to heal up his heroes again. He got two riflemen. He's going for the first attack upgrade. He's going for the long range upgrade on the rifleman. He already got that by now. Second priest is coming. Sobi Mask for the Naga. A beautiful item. Level 3 for the Demon Hunter, which is even more important. Tier 3 take just got started, so it actually got quite delayed. Because the Hunter's Hall got killed. I felt like he will probably take to Tier 3 without lores but maybe this would have been too greedy he needs to get a snipe on that naga like if he's not killing that naga the push will come or he needs to snipe uh, the priest but he's going for some creeping so rich could definitely be in trouble with that scout farm in his main base hawk knows the exact tech timing gets the naga up to level two by that creeping that's of course helpful but in the meantime i'm not so sure why he's still committing to that fight he should have known that there's a push coming his way there was a shop being constructed that just died or there actually is a shop something like ah it was actually a moon well in construction that just died Demonata picks up an invo potion and a heal scroll and now he needs to take a really good cardio training to get into his base before everything is dead he just decides to use the town portal the quick path what you should always get when you go through a theme park a theme park is the quick pass access as we have this yeah we do have this but he dispels both of them one time there's a bear coming out just with a depth training no step of preservation don't get me wrong there's absolutely no chance of getting that one out he needs to snipe the archers now he realizes that snipes the uh, not the archers he needs to snipe the priest realizing that now goes for the rifleman really well done so far by mr rich he's doing a great job now going for the naga level two mana burn 
makes the Demon Hunter so much stronger, but he doesn't have the boots of speed, so he will not get the kill on that hero. And the Demon Hunter, with the scroll of healing as well as the Invo Potion, is running away from his army, he leaves the Dryads exposed, and the Dryads have to pay the poor price for this fella just betraying his children. What are you? What kind of a father are you, mate? He just went on a cigarette break, wanted to pick another pack and never came back. But actually he came back and he cared. And now he's going to try and kill that Archmage, but he will not get the kill. So he drove away both of the heroes because they are kind of low. He killed the priest to lower the amount of sustain. Now the Naga is in a little bit of trouble, but he's kiting the Archmage on the other side. Archmage forced to town portal is just buying a little bit more time. Can you kill the Naga in time? Oh, almost a headshot, but still well played by Ridge. Level 2 Naga is dead, but he, what, the only resource that he needs right now is time. He will have Master Bears in a second. Naga is being revived. The towers are not up because he never upgraded that one. And now he's trying to get rid of these workers before the human player is coming back. Another one is abandoning the kids. But this time the Demon Hunter, by killing one more, he will go up to level 4. He needs, I think he needs a shop somewhere, but he never went for a shop. He finally killed that scout farm. So Hawk is also supply blocked at 48 supply now. Both of the heroes are actually just got one heal scroll. Maybe you should buy another healing... Maybe sh he just got one healing potion. You should rather buy an invo potion or a heal scroll or maybe both. But it seems like he will give some time to Rich. He's not going on an immediate counter attack or rego. He gives him some time to creep up. And I'm not sure if I like this all that much. Doesn't get the mana burn on the hero. Big invo potion being dropped. That's of course a nice drop for him. That Naga should not die. There's still a scout tower in the main base. Can you please kill that one, Rich? Please! So two bears are being constructed. I'm not sure, doesn't he have... He doesn't have any dryads. So level two water elements are kind of scary. And now the red camp is being pulled. And this is the same that we have seen on Echo Isles. At some point, Hawk will do some pressure. And if that pressure falls off, of course, he's like fended off or he, he feels like he needs to go back. He's taking it the long road. He's he's going for a long game. I'm not so sure if this is the right approach because I, I feel that riflemen are falling off in the later stages, even with two attack upgrades. Finding a level two, uh, finding a level plus, uh, well, a level, a plus 12 class of attack here goes up to plus 18 damage with that Naga. That's just ridiculous. Turns out to be a super Naga now with the big invo potion equipped. Naga on the other side for Rich is level 3 with a Sobi Mask. Level 2 Fork Lightnings will be spent all over the place. I'm not sure if he should really go for that late game, but he's playing this push like so many times. He's so familiar with every aspect of that strategy and he is a high level player, so he knows what he's doing. And I will just give him that and uh, yeah. My reasoning is different. I don't value Rifleman a bit. But different players have different approaches about the game. So Archmage 3.8, Naga is level 3 as I stated it, level 4 for the... Oh, two more experience on the ground! Mm, gets that one on the Naga, juicy one. That super Naga picks up on Steam again. Two more experience just eaten. He needs a uh, mental, or what does he need? He actually needs like endurance aura or something. What is it? Legion do more. That's basically uh, like an endurance aura. Super Naga is on the field. Let's go. Bears are attacking a breaker, the one and only breaker on the field. Now he can use all the re rejuvenations in the world because there's no dispel on the priest. Nice snipe there from Rich. He can easily fall back and just creep the remaining creeps from that creep camp. A player's forces are under attack. Hawk didn't know that this camp is already crept. I think he wanted to fall back into the fountain to heal up and creep that one. Finds himself at an empty fountain where there's absolutely nothing to fall back into. Anti-magic potion. Archers with raw, they're kind of nice. Archers and dryads, like if you raw the archers and shoot with the archer and dryads at the priest or sorceress, they die like super quick. Archmage struggling to get that level 2 mana aura for himself. Fe uh, 57 supply right now for the human player. Breaking into upkeep. 50 supply still for Rich. He wants to pull the second red camp that is already gone because uh, Hawk was a little bit faster there. 
He's now upgrading the defense again of his bears, while we see two attack upgrades already for the rifleman. Maybe at some point you should also upgrade the defense for your rifleman, I don't know about that. Maybe you should put like all emphasis on rifleman and upgrade them 2-2. Demon Hunter wants to go to level 5, he gives solo experience to his hero, not earning a bit of XP there with his naga, and the second Sobi mask drops to the ground beautiful item for the naga as well as a ring of protection plus two which is not such a nice item but the super naga on the other side no town pole though for hawk keep that in mind guys and demon hunter close to level five i'm not sure if like either you break upkeep right now or you expand if you're a war chief you expand and you just go for the split push game like construct an expansion somewhere and just go for the main base of your opponent and bypass him like a couple of times. You don't have to win the game in a straight up fight. You don't have to do this. Sobi masks do stack. Yes, they do. It's, you can see the mana regeneration right now in the Naga is kind of ridiculous. It's basically like... I'm not sure if it's like uh, Burns Aura level 2. But it kind of feels that way. Uh, Burns Aura level 2 is even faster I feel. Wow, Fog Lightning on only one unit. High ground against low ground. I think he is not willing to approach that fight, but there's no... Uh, actually, there is a Town Portal on Rich side, so he can pull out of this fight if it gets too dicey. Commits to it. Fog Lightning on the Peasants. Peasants are all dead. The Militias have to say GG. Level 5 for the Demon Hunter now, and taking a fight against high ground is nothing... That's something in your in your uh, like book of strategies that you should completely scratch out. Never fight a high ground fight, even if you have like a sick supply lead. You can still lose the fight, like missed chances are reasonable in this game. And now he's going for the push, he should just set up an expansion at this point. Don't go for a fight, just like kill that main base, you will be faster, you have siege bears. Yeah, he's going for that, he got one wisp outside of the main base, he got another wisp down here. That's just beautiful. This is how you play some beautiful Walker. There's no Town Portal on Hawk. So you can still just like stretch the game forever. There are like a few peasants escaping. That's not the perfect idea of this game. Or is he going to Town Portal in to actually take a stand in his main base? But so many movers already died. He's actually taking a stand. He's jumping back in. He wants to take that fight. He killed the human main base, there's no more keep, it's gone, but the fighting position is not all that great, I have to say. The Naga is a little bit exposed, there's no Staff of Preservation on the Demon Hunter. Still like a few of these Moonwells that are full, but the fighting position, the Concave for the human player, I feel is pretty good. I'm not sure why he's retreating, he should definitely take a stand there and take the fight. It cannot get any better, everything is clumping up a little bit, the Breakers need to get back so that he's not losing all of them. Rejuvenation will be a, a mistake there. Oh, he's diving in with his rifleman because he was targeting one single bear that got stepped out and everything just kind of moved with that. He needs another heal scroll, pops with the second heal scroll. It's still looking kind of desperate for Hawk, but maybe, only maybe, is able to secure himself the victory on Secret Valley, but it looks really grim already. The Super Naga is not turning out to be as super as I introduced her to be. And beside that, the bear numbers are still kind of high. A few bears are still chopping through these uh, riflemen. And two upgrades on the bears. Two defense upgrades. No more heal scrolls. No more healing potion. Invo potion about to wear off. Level 5 demon hunter picking up more and more steam. Killing more and more units. Level 4 archmage completely exposed. Where's the fork lightning? No mana for that. GG. Good luck in final. And we're gonna have ourselves a Knight of Mirror. Sonic against Ridge in the final. GG and well played by War Chief Rich and big shoutouts to you 1100 guys watching at the moment you guys are amazing please make sure to smack that follow button if you enjoy this commentary because we also have like some gameplay when we are not casting games so that game was beautiful not sure what will happen right now I just like open up my window 